guys. So today we are going to be testing Jenny here. See how much she knows about basketball. Because basketball is a big part of my life. And uh, I want to see how much she knows. Because uh, she's actually been to a few basketball games now. And I'm wondering if she knows what's going on. Alright, so what happens is I've got 10 questions here. And I'm going to test her. And let's see how many of the 10 she gets right. Okay. So you ready? What is it called when you walk without dribbling? Last name. Watch this, Jenny. Oh my god. <laughs> Jenny Come Carter? On. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. Let's get it going. Come on. Travel. Ah, correct. Off to a great start. Okay. Second question. What is it called when you have to shoot from a specific spot when someone fouls you on a shot? I'll read it again. <laughs> what is it called when you have to shoot from a specific spot when someone fouls you on a shot? You are, I guarantee you that. Wait, I get three hints as well, yeah. Is, yeah. That, is that part of the rules? Is it free throw? Yeah, it is. What the heck? <laughs> Wait, let's establish the rules. Like they say, I guess like three times and I'm all like, I have no idea. Can I ask for a hint? Yes. Okay. Okay. Third question. Da -da 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 -da. Welcome to my show. And your host, Kenny Hewen. <laughs> question number three. What is it called when someone shoots a shot as time runs out and makes it, usually to win a game? A three wins the series. It's Lillard. He got the shot off. Seen one of those before. How would I give you a multiple choice of it? All right. Wait, wait, wait. I'll read the question yeah. again. Okay. What is it called when someone shoots a shot as time runs out and makes it, usually to win the game? Would you like it to be multiple choice? That is your hint. <laughs> is it end point? Game point? Locking in your answer. <laughs> no, you tell me if it's right or wrong out of the two. Okay, you got it wrong. <clears throat> okay, fine. Give me the multiple choice. <laughs> a, a three pointer. No. B, game over shot. C, timeout shot. D, buzzer beater. <laughs> and A, B, C, D, E. <laughs> a layup. I'll repeat the question. No, it's a layup. What is it called when someone shoots a shot as time runs out and makes it, usually to win the game? Game over shot. Game over shot. Locking in B. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> you are incorrect. Really? What is it? The shot that is... Uh, Time out cool. shot? Nope, it's a buzzer beater. What? Really? Yes, I've never heard you say that. Because... What is it called when someone jumps with the ball and pushes it through the hoop? Layup? Are you sure? <laughs> you can't do that to me! You say yes or no! No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You want the multiple choice? Yes. <laughs> a. A dunk. B. A layup. C, a swish. Isn't a dunk where you hang from the hoop? You tell me. <laughs> a dunk? Yes, correct. Okay. I don't know, I'm not going to give you that one because you got it wrong because you said layout. But I, I thought a dunk is when you hang from... But do you push it through the hoop? I thought a push is different. What's diff what is a push? I thought, I thought a dunk is like when you... Push the ball through the hoop and hold <sighs> on to the rim, yeah? And what's a layout? It's just laid up. Oh, you like place it in the room. All right, question number five. Da -da 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 -da. What is it called when someone stops in front of the defender, allowing the offender to go by? Oh, what a pick there by DeAndre! Oh man, straight laid him out. <laughs> I don't know, block. Hey, block slash stop. I said. Is B. it a block? B. No, is it a block? Get the say yes or no. I said block first. No. Mm. I now it's a 50 50 for you. Block slash stop is A. Mm -hmm. B. Slam slash dunk. And C. Pick slash screen. C? Yes. But I don't know. I'm going to give you that one too. Do I give it to you the point? Yes. So you're telling me you've only got one wrong? <laughs> Let's say I say block. And you were like, that's wrong. And I'm like, I want to use multiple choice now. I get another chance? No. Oh, uh, no. yes. 
which is what I, just I don't did. know. Which is what I just did. Okay, so you only got one wrong, but you only have Fine. one multiple choice left. Fine. And how many questions do I have left? You like have three? four. Okay. Question number six: What is it called when the ball goes through the hoop without touching the backboard or rim? Russell picked up by Kuzma. Russell got it. Back in the clock, he realizes what's going on. Kuzma's hands are down. He's got space. Excellent rotation. And, and that is. Would you like to use your last multiple choice, or would you like to? Would you like to phone a friend? <laughs> you can phone a friend. You can call Matt. Really? Yeah. Go. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is a crazy lifeline. I wish we had more structure to this video. <laughs> I'm just making up rules here. It's my, but it's my talk, my game show. What up? Hey Matt, can I ask you a quick question? It's about basketball. Yeah. It's for a video. Yeah. All right. What is it called when the ball goes through the hoop without touching the backboard or rim? Swish. Swish? Yeah. <laughs> Big. Thank you, Matt. That's okay. <laughs> so, I've never heard of that term. So now you only have one life, one life. What is the orange part of the basket called? A hoop. Mm. Wrong. Would you like to use your multiple choice? What? It is wrong. It's not called a hoop. It's not called a hoop. What? Wait, what's the question? What is the orange part of the basket called? What? <laughs> the, the, Would you like to use... The ring! Wrong. Mm. <laughs> what the heck? Oh. Would you like to use last multiple choice? Fine. The board, the rim, or the square? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> the rim. Ah, ding, Oh ding, my ding, god, ding. I hate this game. Alright, question eight. On a block shot, which part of the square are you supposed to hit? What? On a block shot, so when you shoot it from the block. From where? The block? Yes. What's the block? Ah, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's not going to help you. What part of the square are you supposed to hit? The corner? Yes. Ding, 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 ding. And number nine. When are you supposed to dribble with two hands? Uh, during a free throw? Wrong. Never. Is that your question? Yes. Oh my god! And lucky <laughs> last here. Was the quiz hard? Are you serious? That's the question. No, I'm joking. Are right, you ready? This is going to be a tough one for you, right? And I have no more lifelines? No, I have one more. No, I don't. You have no more lifelines. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? What mascot represents... Boy. Sunbury, the club that Matt Jets. Oh, okay, <laughs> well, she's eight. So which I'll be mean nine. She got nine. Which question did I get wrong? Let's go back and check. Did I get two wrong? I think you got two wrong. When we watch the video, we'll let you know, but clearly she cheated. I didn't. You had unlimited guesses. So you're saying for when I do you, you can't have unlimited guesses? I have unlimited guesses. Well, we didn't even clarify before we did the test. So yeah. I'm not cheating. Okay. Well, this is the first time I've tested her for basketball. Maybe I'll come with another 10 Are questions. You I am. You know, 70%, that's a C. It's alright. But, uh, okay. In the next video, it'll be her testing me on makeup or girl stuff. So, we've established the rules. What there's gonna be is three lifelines. And one call a friend. And one phone a friend. Who would you call? My sister. Thanks for watching, guys. Sorry for the little, you know, unorganized stuff. But, you know, we're learning. Just like she's learning what the orange part of the basket is. Rim. I was close. Ring is not. Hoop? They have logical answers. Eh. See you guys.